this is where we left in a previous video whereby we were trying to update the order using our webhook but unfortunately we got this error so let's look at what kind of error and how can we fix it the error says that cast to object id failed for this value this means that we are trying to find the order by this id but mongodb requires the actual object id but we use this one that is the id as a string and that is what we pass in when we're creating the order if you go to the order controller here we are passing in the order id and then we stringified it as that so to bring this one back to object id inside the webhook we are going to pass the object id as json.pass so i'm going to cut this one from here and make use of json.pass then i'll paste in the id and this one will fix the error so let's try to place an order and let's have a look if our webhook will update that particular order so i'll hit send and I have the URL. I'm going to copy this URL and back to Chrome and I'll paste the link. And let me enter some dummy email for payment and let me pay. All right, so let's check the terminal and let's see. You can see this time around we have the order being updated. And these are the updated data about the order using our webhook. We have the payment status, meaning paid, and then the payment method, the person used card, the total price paid, the currency, and status pending. For this one, we are going to allow the admin to change the status to shipped or delivered or processing. So now our order is working with the webhook. What has left is the order management by the admin, meaning that the admin is going to change the status to pending or to shipped or to processing. All right, let's continue in the next video.